Oh, am I getting filmed? <laughs> yes. This is an Astra feed day. Oh, is. We gotta get the Astra out. Look how big she's getting now. Oh, don't go under the dirt. Don't be like that. Grab her tail. <laughs> she's a new bag. No, she just went to try and strike at me. You still have some skin in there. <laughs> Yeah, we need to measure that last one. No, you can't. It she ripped it all up and oh. tried eating it and stuff. Oh, that's a shame. She attacked her. The she, next one. Yeah, she attacked her on shed skin. She's right up there. Yeah. But I'm looking at her body there. She goes wraps herself right round it now. And we go. I might be able to grab her. Oh my god. She's like a sand snake. <laughs> I get the end of her tail, I don't get the base of it, or the middle, I get the end of it. You are so... This is why she would never make it in the wild, she's an idiot. <laughs> oh, come out. She's trying to go through glass. <laughs> Lots of fan in the background. What are you going to do if she hurtles over the top like she's done in the past? Grab her. Come on, you're going to have something to eat. You're have your mousey. You were staring at me, licking your lips, basically. You're going to have your mousey. Yeah, I'll just jump into there. There we go. <laughs> Yay! She wrapped herself around the arm then. Look how big she is. Turn that round. Look at that. Is she a big girl now? How many months are we on about now? There. Thing there. Oh, right, right, do that again. She was about seven months. She's about seven months old. No, you seven months old. Seven months October. old. You had her. October what? Four. O October the seventeenth. Seventeenth. She was born. So October, November, December, January, February, March, April, May, June. So it's eight months. So we've had her seven months. I can't believe we've had her seven months. Yeah, we've had her since Christmas. Just before Christmas, I got it for you, didn't I? Got her for you. Little Astra, look at that. Those pretty colours. She hungry. She hungry, girl. Get your head down and I'll feed you. I know, I'm showing off my bottom bit to everyone. Look how pretty I am. It's a shame these boxes aren't more see-through. Yeah. Like clearer. They're so fogged up. It's not the camera, it's a box. We've got a bigger cat we got a bigger box if you look, it's higher up. Because she likes to because, throw her head back. Yeah, she likes to put her head up when she's eating to slip it down quicker. Um there is no blood in this video. We're just gonna see her strike hopefully. Try and get her to strike. She strikes when we use the tongs. Put that on my camera there. Right, do you want me to hold? You, you need to get her. I've got it. You got it? You alright? 
Yeah, you can do I've that. I've done it one-handed before. Okay. Just checking. Right, Astra. Strike, baby. Oh. Yeah, I dropped it, Mum. She can't smell it. See, no blood. No, she ain't gonna do it. That's alright, we'll just watch her. We'll have to get a strike next time. She does it most when she's in her coconut because at times I can't get her out. Yeah. Because she's um, that hungry, she wants to eat eat you, don't she? Yeah, she tried striking her striking at me before you got the camera on that. Well she had you the other week, didn't she? She caught Oh her. yeah, she went to strike at me, I moved my hand just in time but I got scraped with her fangs. Yeah. Quite deep. Mm -hmm. I just yeah. think she's fascinating how wide she can get her mouth open. I'm sorry. I'm hungry. Yeah. Considering the size of that mouse now. I mean, she's on, what's she on now? Large pinkies. Large pinkies now. Good job, Bobo. <coughs> she's enjoying that. Like she's trying to chew it. Mm. Yeah, no, it's the way she um, gets it down her throat. You idiot. You've got the leg stuck in the side of your mouth. Mm. <laughs> that's dog's barking. Yeah, that's our dog. And your dog. Who we've had for six weeks, six and a bit weeks. It was seven weeks Tuesday, it's now Sunday. This is a Sunday feed. Here's our new fur baby from Battersea. And this one's from Pets at Home. And she was new. And she beautiful. I found it crazy you can see her tongue. They retract their tongue into their mouth and it leaves a hole. Just the tail. Slap it up, big eyes. I love the way she crinks her neck to get it down. I mean, I'm not a snake lover. I'll probably never pick her up, but she's just fascinating. Oh, I will make you pick her up one day. <laughs> yeah, when she's fully grown, not this size. She's too bloody quick. Yeah, I have a hard time getting to her. She's got hiccups. <laughs> she always gets hiccups. It might just be her tensing from the mus uh, from her it muscles. It could be. I don't know. If anyone knows why she opens her mouth, opens her mouth after she's eaten, she looks like she's got the cups. <laughs> we say it's the cups because she looks so cute when she does it. Yeah, but I'm the snake lover, and um, my brother is as well. There you go. See, she does that. So I don't know if that's her like digesting or whether that's, you know, whether she has got the little hiccups. But I say it's hiccups because it's cute and she's cute. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I wouldn't be that brave to pick her up, so. <clears throat> I'm a dog lover. I wouldn't say she's only bitten me twice though. Yeah. First when I got her. Because she got scared by her two dolls. Yeah. And then the second time was because she was hungry. Mm. Actually, no, you shouldn't have been hungry because I fed you the day before. Well, she just fancied a chew on you. She ain't poisonous, so she can't hurt you. No. Thank it's God. Just, it's not even. Her bite doesn't even hurt because how short, small she is. It's like. Shall I just tell you this? If you ever get a poisonous one, you make sure you've moved home first. <laughs> I ain't getting a poisonous one. You have to have a license for it. Because uh, I'm, oh, I'm not going there. If I ever do get another one, <coughs> I'm going to go for a hog nose. Yeah, I like them. They're cute. They have little, and also it makes it harder for them to bite you. They mm. can bite, but they're more dopey. <sighs> what we should have held out for probably but she's cute yeah and she's so pretty coloured she thinks she's an anaconda um the not rattlesnake she does t uh, rattle her tail she tries to 
<laughs> but she thinks she's um, one of the ones where King Cobra. Yeah. She thinks she's one of those, and she like turn, uh, swivels her head. <laughs> Kind of like what she's doing now, but she does it just in her enclosure. <laughs> right, Baba Boo, you could go back to your bedroom. Already put your stuff back when mm. you like it. Mm. Okay. Right, go. Yep. There she goes. Let's have a quick look. Beautiful colours. The snake is right there. With yeah, you can see the little bulge, so she don't need anything bigger just yet. No, not just yet. Next version will be small fuzzies. Yeah. Which will be cute. I just find it funny how they name that food very cute names Pinky and Fuzzy. <laughs> and then it's like, I'm, I'm feeding a dead rat to my <laughs> snake. Come on, you normally do this eat your oh, tail, tail first. first. Obviously. Can't be normal, can you? Yep, that way. There she goes. So I've got a full belly. And I'm going to have a drink. Simple enclosure. I might go into a video on what, how it works and stuff. Well, eventually, when she has one, it's going to be five foot long. So it's going to be, be like bigger than my table. It, yeah, I'm not going to show you a table. Have you seen the mess on it? Yeah. The um, it will take the whole of that wall up. We will have to put the TV on the wall, and then the closure will go right along there. So it will go from this end of the shelf, where's my finger, there, to there. end of the shelf, to right it. down to the bottom and that will take the whole table up then. And then my PS4 will go up here and yeah. my TV will go there. Yeah, um, but so that's, that's not till the end of the year. No, she still Because she's got plenty of room. Small. Yeah, she was tiny when we got her anyway. Yeah, no, but um, she snakes like staying in enclosures, um, small uh, like where they. I are mean, it might not up. even be till next year. It depends on how quick she, she grows. Yeah. So. No, normally they like stay in an enclosure that they have to half their body weight, so they keep it closed, mm -hmm. so they feel more secure. But we want to so. get her more, we want to get her a skull and we want to get her some more sticks because she loves wrapping herself around the sticks and climbing up them and that, didn't she? Yeah, and then falling off of them because oh, yeah. she loses grip. <laughs> so, but we want to make sure she's got plenty of uh, fun things fun things to do and she's not bored. Yeah, I feel like she is bored at times because she's only got two things in there because it's too small. Yeah, no, she'll be alright for now. She's got plenty to do. Uh, she zooms about at the moment anyway. Okay then, so yeah. so that's the end of today's video. So like, hit subscribe, hit the bell to get notified for every single video, and goodbye. Bye, Bye guys. Bye from Mum.